Hello, Nomads Cult, and this video is about yeah, creating alpha images without painting apps because you don't need them for such easy alpha patterns. So uh, today I saw a, a tutorial video about creating such a, um, a alpha image here, and yeah, I. So I start uh, with an example, so I delete this. In fact, it's when you add a plane primitive, such a 2D plane, it's nothing else um, than a blank square canvas in Procreate or Photoshop or other app. So you see here um, the, the grid here, and this is uh, nothing else uh, like uh, the pixels. Uh, on a canvas. So this is a blank white canvas. So in fact you need only sometimes a little bit more topology, so more pixels. So yeah. And if you want to create such a... Um, um, here, sorry I validate this uh, and here I show you. So here for uh, such black and white and um, um, maybe grayscale uh, alphas with a, uh, what's the name for it, um, a gradient or something, you don't need a other app. Okay, so for this example with the stripes here, um, you only need here the cell mask and here mask the one stripe here, but at the moment it's a, a, a mask. So, and for the gradient, you can here blur the mask. Sorry. So blur it. And this is, the blur is the gradient. Uh, okay, I hope you understand. And then uh, use here the color and use a black color because we have a white canvas and paint all. So now you can clear. So you see here now, this is the gradient and uh, the white stripe. Okay, nothing else we need. So here in the MISC menu of the object here, you find here a, a baking option and you can bake here the color from itself. So here you can choose your resolution 1K, 2K, 4K and so on and I need only 512. Okay, so I press bake from itself. Now you find here in the textures, in the material menu, you find here your baked alpha. And this is all you need here, because if you want a, such a repeating pattern here, so you only have to change here the scaling. So when you use uniform scale, um, sorry, I painted uh, white again, so, sorry. So with the scaling, you can change here the lines you need on your canvas. And here, let's zoom a little bit in. So here's a, a small problem here in this zone, uh, because we repeat it also in, in this direction. So uh, in fact, we don't need it. So. Then you get here this repeating pattern. And again, so here color and bake from itself. So then you find here um, your alpha image. And so we can test it. So we add up a sphere. And validate and we need more topology so we subdivide it 
a little bit. So let's test it now with a stamp brush. So we change the alpha and so I replace this and you find it now in the files menu, Nomad Sculpt, TMP, Textures and here you see at the top your baked image. So now you can test it. So and it's up to the blurring you use um, what you get. So and the nice thing here is um, for this you can also um, change the rotation and so on <coughs> and bake it again. Um, yeah. So that's an easy way to create such alpha images. And a little bit complexer or so here is my canvas so I validate it and use here a multi resolution I subdivide it a little bit more and in fact it's when you use here the painting tool so I reset it to the last thing when you use here um, a black color so and you paint here you see here the pressure settings of the brush so the radius and the intensity so you can deselect these options and you see here the fall off and here the fall off is the gradient of the black color. So you can adjust it here like this or so, like you want. This is the gradient what you get. And now when you paint, you get the gradient on the canvas. So. Okay, like this. And then here, um, color, bake from itself. So then you see here your alpha image. And then again, add a sphere. So, and now use again the stamp tool. So we change, we replace this alpha, we find it in the files, Nomad Sculpt, TMP folder, textures, and here you find your... And now you see here... Oh, I have to select it. You see here our um, yeah, X sign and here it's possible to invert it. So now our X works. So this is our stamp. So no uh, other application needed. Um, yeah. And you can change here the intensity to get such um, nice alphas. So I hope it helps. Have fun with sculpting and ciao.